What's going on with your, uh, is it, it's like your liver or like your kidneys? Yeah. I, I see that. God's pointing that out to me. And like there's a back pain, like a lower back yeah. pain that you get. It's probably just too much Coca-Cola. And, and your feet, your feet hurt. They get like uh, yeah, they swollen. Hurt. Yeah, they do. They hurt in my, in my lower back right here. Yeah. Yeah. How do I know that? Oh, my God. And there you go. My psychic. Right. He gets the glory yes. for it, right? So, so what I, so God is showing me that area, right? Like your liver and your kidneys. And he highlighted it immediately when I looked at you, right? And then he, he showed me that you were getting like lower back pain yes. and you didn't know why. And you were getting ankle and feet and they were uh, getting inflamed or they were uh, swollen, swollen hurt, right? Yeah. They're hurting. And that's all true, right? It is true. It is. Okay. So God is mentioning that because you're praying about it. Yeah. You're like, I don't got money to go to the doctors. I don't want to go to the doctors. Yeah, you're right. There's like anxiety there with the doctors, what they're going to tell you. And God doesn't want you to have that fear. He loves you. Because right. I see you speaking to other women about God a yes, lot. Yes, I do. I you're do. always telling oh, them wow. about Jesus Christ and about what they need to do. Wow, you're giving people lots so, of... I want to cry because it's so real. It's so true. Wow. Okay, that's the going. calling on your life. You're an evangelist. Yes, and ever yes. since you were young, God said you've always had a special relationship with him. And even though you were you were hurt, like I see uh, abuse to you, abuse, oh, yeah. a lot of physical abuse to you. That was, I see the word sex over you. So, yeah, so yeah. it was it was abuse, right? Mm -hmm. And that hurts you a lot. But through that, the Lord's always been with you. You've always been strong. Mm -hmm. And I see you speaking to the people out here and yeah. speaking to people in your life. And you're always giving them wisdom, yes. counsel. They come to you and they call you mama. I, see, I hear people yeah, call you yeah, mama they do, they who do. aren't your kids. Yeah. Mom, I see you cooking. I see food that, that you are distributing to people, but it's not just physical food, it's spiritual food. And God uses you to give mercy. He says, put a grace on your life to give mercy. Mercy, mercy, mercy. You always give a mercy to people. And I see people when you're not looking, I see a knife in your back and I see them taking your stuff. That's what I see. So I see you in an apartment. And I don't know, are you, are you, are you in an apartment now? Where are you at in the house? I'm in the house in Rosebud. How long have you been there? Oh, it's my mom's house and she passed and she left it for the family and whoever needed it. Uh -huh. And so- Are you guys I, planning on selling it or something? No. Okay, because no, I saw no, you in the apartment. No, 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 somebody, somebody's trying to sell it, but my mama said don't sell oh, it. Oh, they're so. trying to sell it? Yes. Okay. This they're is trying to sell it. This is why I'm seeing it. Mm -hmm. They're trying to sell it, but I, she said don't sell it and don't knock it down, whoever needs it. Come live in it. But it's going to be sold. Getting, it's going to be sold. It's going to, they're going to get in trouble. Yeah, they're going to sell it. They're and going to get in trouble. That's why I saw you in an apartment. So God's letting me know to let you know that in the future. When it happens, don't be afraid, right? Don't be afraid. He's going to give you a place to live. Oh, yeah. So he's going to take care of you. Yeah. So how long have they been trying to sell it, even though you don't want them to sell it? Since 2018. So, okay. So they've been, they were trying, they've yeah. been trying to do it. So... This is, this is, and when you started telling me that, I, I heard the Lord, and the Lord said, it's going to happen. They're going to sell it. And when they sell it, he's going to give you, you're going to be yeah, in the apartment. Yeah, yeah, I, I mean, I do, I do know that he gives you, provides you what you need, where, shelter, food, and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. But legally, can they sell it if I don't sign, when they, you know, sign? Who was? Who, my sister. It was your sister? Who was what? Is it, who's, who's the house under what name? My mother's. Okay. And she illegally put it in her name. Who your sister did? Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> That's making sense. Why, why did you jump Because like that? that lets me know that what God is saying. That's confirmation to me that it's going to be sold. You come and yeah, join. Yeah, I would love to do that, but I'm in Rosebud. I'm just Where's here that at? on the other side of Wake about two hours. Oh, okay. You're just here. Okay. I'm here because I wanted to come and see my brother. Okay. Because... But I haven't made it there yet, and I don't know why I'm taking my time because I don't want to face my sister mm -hmm. because I'm going to tell her, don't sell this house, yeah. and don't da 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 da. You know, I'm going to probably get into it. So you were planning on talking to her about that already. This is God. Wow. See, that's God. See, so, so, because he went to jail and they mishandled him, and now he can't walk. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what's going on with him. So I want to come see for myself, but mm -hmm. they don't tell me anything. Yeah. Know, so I, 
So that's what I'm here for. So, but I would love to. And if I get an apartment and, and they sell the house, I will be back in Fort Worth. But okay. You can give me your card and I will call you. Yeah, yeah. Well, I will stay in contact with you. Yeah. Maybe that's for the Lord. Yeah. Maybe that's why I'm seeing the apartment. It's because in the future you're gonna be over here. Yeah, yeah. Living oh, back. Yeah. Living back over here. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Uh, that's amazing. This is God. It's so amazing. Good. He is amazing. Wow. He is. And that's what they've done to you. And God yeah. says, they've done this to you. Now it's time for you to be lifted up what? because of all your good works. So oh, He's been healing. Does all that make sense to you? Yes. Hallelujah. It's, it's my sister's. Stabbing you in the back. Yes. Okay, I saw people. I saw a knife in your back, yes. symbolically. Ow. And God said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fight for you. Oh, because wow. what they're saying against you and what they're doing is, I didn't know it was your sisters. God just showed me the knife, yeah, right? Yeah. So he showed me the knife and showed me that it was people, right? And it was people that were coming against you. And God says, no, yeah. what they're doing is lies. Yes, yes, yes. And he said, I'm going to defend you. But people are believing them. Yes, God's they are. Yes, That's they what are. God's telling me. Yes, but God are. says, I'm about to vindicate you. I'm going to lift yes. you up. Yes. And they're going to see that you were the one who was telling the truth. Yes. You were the one that was doing the right thing. Yeah, wow. you make mistakes, but your heart has been genuine. Yes. Yes. You're always trying to do the right wow. thing. And so the devil, he's turned people against you, even your own family, where yeah. they turn against you. Uh, but God is about to restore that. Oh, wow. So, and then the, the physical pain that you've been dealing with also, he's going to take that from you. Stand so right here, close your eyes, relax. A hand on you. Okay. In the name of Jesus Christ, right now, every wicked spirit that's coming against your health, coming against your, your kidneys that's causing infirmity in your body, swell, the swelling in your ankles and feet, the pain, everything that is happening in your body right now, I command those demons to leave now in Jesus' name and for healing all through your body from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet right now. Be healed right now, right now. Come into order now in the name of Jesus Christ right now, all of it, all of it. And I speak to... I speak to your life and there's going to be a great restoration, restoration when it comes to your family. God is going to vindicate you. Like I said, people are going to repent. People are going to come, come to you and apologize to you and see that you were always doing the right thing or trying to do the right thing and that your heart was genuine from the very beginning. So right now, right now. I feel like I'm lighter. I feel it from your hands to my head and it just goes all the way down. How's the pain in your body? I, feel, I don't feel no pain. I don't, you know, I got a little pressure on my feet because I'm standing. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't feel no pain. Okay. My so shoulder lifted a little. Did you have shoulder problems? Just to, just from the bag. Oh, okay, what's up? Now it feels you know, good. Yeah. Praise the wow, Lord. Wow. That's, that's the amazing. Holy Spirit. Yeah.